How to create a virtual business card step by step. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we will be taking a quick look at how you can create a virtual business card. So let's get into it. Now for this, you don't need any premium softwares. All you need to do is have Canva, which is available for free and you can sign up with your email and QR code monkey, which is also available for free. Now, both of these tools will enable you to create an amazing business card. For a virtual business card, you can go about this in two ways. You can create a business card with just a QR code, or you can create a business card with your basic business information, like your business name, and maybe a Instagram or social media handle or website link, and then a QR code. So let's get into starting this design. Now, to get started, simply head on over to canva.com. Canva.com is available for free. You can go into the search bar and search for business card. So you guys can see you have a business card in portrait mode or also a business card rounded corner and landscape. Depending on what you want to create with business cards, you can choose to just search it as it is and you will see multiple different business card templates in both portrait and landscape form. Now with your digital business card, you can also refer to it to send it digitally as well or if you're sending out like specific items or actual physical products you can choose to send a virtual business card with that as well these are amazing options to expand your business so you can choose to use this online or print these out as well so you have a bunch of different templates to pick out from you can choose any template that you want obviously a business card if you're going to print it out you're going to have two sides to it so you can just make the back side a plain print with maybe your um just like a theme of your business and then the front side is going to be your actual business information like it is on a standard printed business card so you guys can see there are quite a few different templates that you can pick out from uh let's just take a basic example template to get started with so I'm just going to take this one over here it's a landscape template and I will just click on customize this template now this one also has two pages which basically means it's a front and back print so first off we're gonna take a look at the back print so this is just a business name and i'm going to enter my own name instead i'm just going to delete the bottom text into my own business initials then in the background you can change the color of different items you can change the color scheme so this is like my shopify store this is just a sample store but let's say I'm trying to build a business card for this and I want to go with like a black and white kind of theme. So I'm just going to change the colors and backgrounds. I can go into elements on the top left and I'm just going to search for a black background and I'm going to convert my text as well. So I'm just going to take my font and use a different font as well like this. So I'm just adding that and then I can go on ahead and add my background as well. And I'm going to be using the same kind of background for both of my front and back sides. So I'm just going to click on layer and then I'm going to click on send to back. And I'm just going to expand it at the back. And then I'm going to maybe change the color of this a little. And then I'm also going to make it translucent, a little translucent. And you can enter your own company logo instead of just inserting text. You can enter your own image if this business card reflects you. Now I'm going to go on ahead and go to the front side. And now I'm going to click on elements. Just add the same background to the back. And then I'm going to click on layer. Click on send to back, making sure it's behind everything. And then from here, I can just go to this one, this section, and just do command C. So I can just copy this. And instead of having to manually change everything over here, I can just paste the logo or the design that I created. You want to insert your logo over here. If you don't have one, you can just customize the pre-existing one. And then you're just going to enter this. You can enter your name. So let's say, and now I'm just going to customize the text color over here, like so. And then you have all of these links. Obviously for a digital business card, you don't want all this information. So I've just deleted all of that and then what you're going to do is you're actually going to insert your QR code for what, wherever you want your business to be at. So let's say you're 
promoting your Shopify store or whatever law firm you might be working in, if you're working in a clinic, whatever website that you might have or Instagram or, you know, Facebook, wherever you're running your business, you want to link that. So now you will open up your website and just copy your website link. Mine is deadend.store. Then you're going to go into the QR code monkey. Now over here, you will just go on ahead and paste your link. So whatever is your link, you're going to create that. Then you can set up specific colors as well. So let's say I want my QR code in white. So you can choose that. You can also choose a color gradient. So let's say we want to do it in some dark hues of yellow, goldish yellow as well, like so, like this. And then you're just going to choose your background color as well. I like to keep it white. And now I'm just going to click on create QR code on the bottom right and you will get a unique QR code. Now you just want to save this QR code. So download this as a PNG and this will open up the link that you set. So for me, this will open up the dead end store and I will just wait for this to be downloaded. And you guys can see the image has been downloaded. Now I'm going to go back into Canva where I'm designing my business card and I will simply upload it so from the left side of your screen. You can see your uploads and you're just going to upload it. I'm just going to drag and drop it and it will automatically upload. So you guys can see it has now been uploaded and I will just resize this and enter it over here. I'm just going to make it fit a little better. So I'm going to move the text a little above so my QR code is a little larger and it's a little easier to scan for my customers. So just like that, now you have an amazing printable and digital business card. You can do this with any kind of business that you might have or any kind of industry that you're in. If this is for your personal portfolio, if you're maybe a consultant, whatever website that you have, even if you're just using Instagram uh, to run your business or to establish your portfolio, you can create a QR code for your Instagram and you know you can skip all of these steps and just use a basic design from Canva. Canva has a lot of basic templates available so you can just go on ahead take a template and enter your QR code directly into that. So a template like this is amazing. It's simple and basic and you can just delete all of this, enter your QR code, your own image and your business card, your digital business card will be ready. So that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel and make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well and to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so i hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if i missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and i will catch you guys in the next video